Hello students, welcome to my channel. Let's solve. I'm Rumoni, your maths teacher. So students, today I'm going to share about a magical trick. Okay, about a hexagon. See students, how many formula? Uh, one from one, this one, this, then this, then this. I'll show you, okay? The trick I will show you. 35 formulae you will be able to uh, remember okay so students so uh, as i have said earlier that uh, these are uh, just substitute okay students uh, it is not like that it's just to uh, remember okay it is just uh, a magic i am going to show you but it doesn't mean that you don't have to know the reason behind why sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to one okay so now let us start so now listen to me students very carefully okay i have drawn one hexagon why it is hexagon because it has how many vertices one two three four five six it has six vertices okay now i will allot the trigonometric function over here trigonometric function means what ten sine cos these are trigonometric function so i will start from ten okay as you are in class 10 so i will start from 10 so see this one 10 10 is equal to sine by cos okay always remember this 10 is equal to sine by cos after that the opposite of 10 is cot the opposite of cos is sec and the opposite of sine is cosec i think you have understood how to write the uh, this 10 sin cos okay after that now we will go in clockwise okay we will start from clockwise and we will get a set of six uh, so, uh, six formulae clear so first one is what 10 is equal to sine by cos okay students then the next one is very interesting sine is equal to cos by cot clear sin theta is equal to cos theta by cot theta after that cos theta is equal to now i am going in what clockwise direction cos theta is equal to cot theta divided by cosec theta after that cosec theta is equal to what sec theta divided by ten theta okay students you have understood i think see after that cosec theta this cosec theta is equal to what sec theta divided by ten theta see we have got we have got six set of what formulae one two three four five six four five six clear students when we will go in clockwise we will get six set of uh, equation sorry six set of formulae clear now we will go in anti-clockwise anti-clockwise means what this way okay in this way we will go now you see 10 theta we can write 10 theta equal to sec theta divided by cosec theta see 10 theta is equal to sec theta divided by cosec theta after that sec theta is equal to in this way we are going sec theta is equal to cosec theta divided by what cot theta then cosec theta is equal to what cot theta divided by cos theta after that cot theta is equal to cos theta by sin theta that means you have i think you have understood the pattern what we are doing we are going in this way isn't it first one is 10 theta is equal to sec theta by cos theta sec theta is equal to cosec by cot after that cosec equal to cot by cos after that cot equal to cos by sin in this way clear in this way we got another six set of formulae clear students now total is what total is our 12 now students let us draw another hexagon okay uh, so let us start from this one 10 theta 10 theta is equal to sine y cos sine equal to what the opposite of sine is equal to cosec after that the opposite of 10 is equal to uh, cot theta and the opposite of cot cos is sec theta Di diagonally we have written done now students from 13 number you see 
sin theta and I have put 1 in the middle. Okay. Now you see sin theta into cosec theta is equal to what? 1. After that tan theta into cot theta is equal to 1. And sec theta into cos theta is equal to 1. Clear? Now the another set of formula is from this. 16 to 20 number. It is very interesting. You see this one student? The first function, this one into the third function. Okay. First and the third and we will get the middle one. See the product of tan theta. Tan theta into cos theta. We will get it as sin theta. See tan theta into cos theta equal to sin theta. After that sec theta what it is given you see sec theta into into cot theta is equal to what cosec theta see sec theta into cot theta is equal to cosec theta that means this into this will be our this one okay after that cosec theta into cos theta is equal to cot theta cosec into cos will be cot okay so I think you got the idea how to do this. See, sin theta into sec theta will be equal to what? Tan theta. Okay, students. Now let us proceed to the next. This one. Diagonally opposite function. See, the diagonally opposite function, this one. Sin theta is equal to what? This one. 1 by cosec theta. Then this one, cosec cos theta is equal to what 1 by sec theta and cot theta is equal to 1 by tan theta so diagonally opposite function okay now students this is about complementary angles and complementary angles means what when the sum of two angle is 90 degree so now you see sine and cos okay sine and cos you can see here uh, sine theta is equal to cos of 90 degree minus theta. We can write it like this. Okay. Or you can write it like sin 90 degree minus theta is equal to what? Is equal to cos theta. Similarly, tan theta is equal to cos uh, cot 90 minus theta and cot theta is equal to tan 90 minus theta. Clear? Then sec theta is equal to cosec theta, uh, cosec theta uh, 90 minus theta and cosec theta is equal to sec 90 minus theta. See students, here you will get six set of uh, formulae. Clear? Now we will proceed to the very important identities. So here you have to go clockwise. See what I have done? I have given this arrow in clockwise. So you have to remember this here. Okay students. And uh, as I have uh, explained this. Tan theta is equal to what? Sin by cos. Then the opposite of tan is cot. Isn't it? Then cos theta is uh, cos. The opposite of cos theta is sec theta. And the opposite of sin theta is cosec theta. See students. I am repeatedly saying this. So that you remember. Okay. Now you see students. We have to go clockwise like this so sin square theta now sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 okay after that 1 we will go in clockwise so 1 plus cot square theta is equal to cosec square theta clear after that this one tan square theta plus 1 is equal to sec square theta I think you have understood this. We have when we will go in clockwise, we will get this formula. Clear? So, students, now we will go in anti-clockwise. Okay, uh, and in anti-clockwise, we will write like uh, minus. Okay, one minus cos square theta is equal to sine square theta. Then cos square theta minus cot square theta equal to 1 in this way okay and the last one is what sec square theta minus 1 equal to tan square theta isn't it interesting yes so in this way you can remember so viewers thanks for watching